Salutations, my Fallout lovers. It is Maddie here today, bringing you some really exciting Fallout news. Now, before anything, be sure to check out the link in the description of my previous video. That is a new episode of Humanity's Worst Video Games featuring Call of Duty and the fanboys are raging. Anyways, really, really exciting Fallout news as I'm here to introduce to you guys a new Fallout game. A game that we never had the chance to fully experience, only to experience a tech demo. This game is Van Buren, a Fallout RPG adventure. And allow me to tell you about this as I talk about it. You guys will see various screenshots of this game and whatnot. So it will be very exciting. Anyways, the mission of this game is to create a classic Fallout game bigger than any other published before. Uh, Van Buren, a Fallout RPG, is a remake of Interplay's canceled Fallout 3 by fans. You are a prisoner in this, the biggest ever Fallout game. And they are using the original design documents. So, basically, if you want to learn even more about this game, there will be a link in the description to uh, their website and their Facebook fan page. Be sure to like them to stay updated on this game, because it's really exciting that we're going to get to experience a Fallout game we never got to play before, which is Interplay's Cancelled Fallout 3. So then I thought to myself, if they're using the original design documents, I know that Fallout's wiki had a like plot description of more in depth of what that game is about so I figured they had the original design documents and wiki had the plot so why not connect the dots and look into more of what this game will be uh, bringing us so the game would have begun with the player character in a prison cell because of this the player was given a choice the player could be an innocent that was in prison because of some misunderstanding or they could choose to be a criminal and take bonus traits that would bolster some of their skills the player would awaken in a prison cell, but not the one they remembered falling asleep in. Suddenly, the floor rocks violently from an explosion, and the player character is knocked unconscious. When they awaken, they find their cell door open and a hole in the wall leading outside. Leaving the prison, the character is under attack by some unknown assailant. Deciding that discretion is the best part of Valor, the player feel flees into the night to explore his world. Unfortunately, this newfound freedom may be short-lived. The player is relentlessly pursued by robots who want to return them to the prison. As they explore the world, they try to outwit their pursuers. They begin to uncover an underlying plot. Why was the character in the prison than the one they fell asleep in? Or a different prison than the one they fell asleep in, I apologize. Why can't they remember anything about being transferred? What was the attack on the prison about in the first place? Then they find out about the NCR's problems, and a few things don't add up. Just like all the titles in the Fallout series, the story ends with multiple endings for every community and faction that you interacted with, and their outcomes depend on your actions. So, awesome as usual, very exciting stuff. One other thing I should mention is that this is going to be running on Fallout Online's engine, and not the Fallout Online that you think of right away, Project V13, that was canceled. I'm talking Fallout Online Reload, and that just makes sense just because of the graphical fidelity of both games. You know, the overhead tactical pixely kind of graphics, and then the decent subpar 2000 whatever graphics that really weren't good at all, and it was going to be a Fallout MMO. So, really exciting stuff. You guys got to like their Facebook page. You got to check out their website for more screenshots than what I showed in this video. A new Fall game is coming our way that we actually haven't experienced. It's not like Fall Online Reloaded where it's kind of playing in the worlds of Fallout 1 and 2 with friends. You know, it's a new Fallout experience, but you've kind of dabbled in those worlds before for most of you guys. This is something new. This is a chance to experience a brand new Fall game and see Interplay's original vision for Fall 3 before the studio got shut down or whatever. So, really exciting, or not the studio getting shut down, before they, they sold the, uh, the franchise. Anyways, um, really exciting stuff, and I hope you guys are as excited as I am. Let's get behind this project, let's support this team of huge fans making a game for us, because it's a new Fallout experience coming our way, and uh, we should do everything we can to help them. So yeah, be sure to like them on Facebook, be sure to check out their website for more screenshots, developer interviews, and whatnot. It's very interesting and exciting. I hope you guys enjoyed. Other than that, my Fallout lovers, stay sexy, stay active. I love you all. Peace.